Read on for everything you need to know about the pioneering scientist, who would have been 287 years old today. Who is Jan Ingenhaus? Mr. Ingenhaus started his career as a physician after studying medicine at the University of Louvain. He took a special interest in smallpox inoculations, the precursor to modern-day vaccinations. At the time, doctors injected an active smallpox pustule into their patients to prevent them from contracting the disease. In London, Mr. Ingenhaus inoculated hundreds of villagers against the disease. He eventually became so skilled at administering inoculations that he was asked to treat Empress Maria Theresa of Austria. He later served as her personal physician. The scientist eventually returned to London, which is where he made his most famous exactly discovery. did he discover? Mr. Ingenhaus is widely credited with discovering photosynthesis, the process by which plants convert light energy into fuel. English chemist Joseph Priestley, however, had already discovered that plants had the power to restore goodness to air that animals had depleted. Through a series of experiments in the late 1770s, Mr. Ingenhaus discovered that light was necessary for this process to occur, and that only the green parts of plants could perform it. He also discovered that all plants damage the air, now known as emitting carbon dioxide, but that they do far more good than harm. What effect did his discovery have? Mr. Ingenhaus' discovery opened the door for a deeper understanding of how plants interact with their...